Hi, I'm Nick and welcome to Repair and Replace, your online resource for quick and easy repairs. In this episode, I'll show you how to replace the aerator and aerator housing for your bathroom faucet. To find the right aerator for your faucet, explore our website below. To begin, you'll need a replacement aerator or aerator housing combo, channel lock pliers, needle nose pliers, and a cloth. Aerators are found on the tips of all faucets. The tiny holes add air bubbles and diffuse the water, giving it a softer feel. Also, aerators restrict the maximum flow rate and will conserve the overall water use. If you've noticed a drop of water pressure or an irregular flow from your faucet, you may need to replace the aerator as it might be clogged with debris. You can replace both the aerator and housing all at once, or just the aerator if you have a decorative styled faucet. Aerator housings come in male and female models. Male aerators have external threads and female aerators have internal threads. Some aerators are hidden within the faucet and require a special tool to remove. First, place a cloth over top of the aerator housing. Use the channel lock pliers to gently unscrew the unit. This will stop the housing from bending out of shape or being scratched. This applies to both male and female housings. If you have a recessed aerator, unscrew by using the tool provided. Now remove the old aerator along with the rubber gasket. If the gasket sticks inside the faucet, use the needle nose pliers to pull it out. Now pop the new aerator into the original housing and place the new gasket on top. If you're replacing both the aerator and the housing, then grab your new unit. Finally, screw the housing back on and hand tighten. If you found this video useful, hit like. To keep up to date on repair and replace, please subscribe. And for the widest selection of parts, low prices, and same day shipping, explore our website below. Thanks for watching.